Shalom, shalom, and greetings. Welcome back to Teshua Hebrew Academy. As we promised, we have now completed the whole chapter of Proverbs 31. And so, my children, they're here today to tell you and uh, quote the whole verse. So, enjoy. And remember, please like, subscribe, and share. We want to send a special greetings to all you that have made comments, Yahweh Baruch, and keep you, and may you have an excellent, excellent young. Shalom to my class. Shalom. Shalom. All right, let's go ahead. All right, we're going to start from verse 1, and let's roll. Here we go. The words of King Lemuel, the prophecy that his mother taught him. What my son, and what the son of my womb, and what the son of my vow. Give not thy strength unto women, nor thy way to that which destroyeth kings. It is not for kings, O Lemuel, it is not for kings to drink wine, nor for princes strong drink. Least they drink and forget the law, and pervert the judgment of any of the afflicted. Give strong drink unto those that are ready to perish, and wine unto those that be of heavy heart. Let him drink and forget his poverty, and remember his misery no more. Open thy mouth for the thumb in the cause of all such as are appointed to destruction. Open thy mouth, judge righteously, and plead the cause of the poor and needy. Who can find a virtuous woman for her price is far above rubies? The lad of her husband does safely trust in her, so that he shall have no need of spoil. She will do him tub and not evil all the days of her life. She seeketh wool and flax, and worketh willingly with her hands. She is like a merchant ship. She bringeth her food from afar. She rises also while it is yet night, and giveth meat to her household, and a portion to her maidens. She considereth the field, and buyeth it. With the fruit of her hands, she planteth a vineyard. She girdeth her loins with strength, and she strengtheneth her arm. She perceiveth that her merchandise is tough, the candle goeth not out by night. She layeth her hands to the spindle, and her hands hold the distaff. She reaches forth her hands to the poor, yea, she reaches forth her hands to the needy. She is not afraid of the snow for all household, for all her household is clothed with scarlet. She maketh herself covering the tapestry, her clothing is silk and purple. Her husband is known in the gates when he sits among the elders of the land. She shaveth her fine linen and selleth it, and delivereth the burdens unto the merchant. She shaveth in honor all her clothing, and she shall rejoice in time to come. She openeth her mouth with wisdom, and her tongue is a law of kindness. She looketh well to the ways of her household, and eateth not the bread of idleness. Her children arise up and call her black. Her husband also, and he praises him. Many daughters have done virtuously, but thou hast heeded them all. Favor is deceitful, and beauty is vain, but a woman that feareth Yahweh, she shall be praised. Give her of the fruit of her hands, and let her own works praise her in the gates. Hallelujah! Shalom! Shalom. Also, we want to send a special greetings to... Thank you, Aunt Charles D. Thank you, Marcus Maxi. We appreciate you very much. Thank you, Rhea. Thank you, Aho Ashley. Thank you, Aho Juanita Landon. Toda Aho Sharia Rose. Toda Aho Sharia Rose. Shalom. So we learn together. My our children are always excited about learning, and I'm excited about teaching. And Daughters of Design on this week, on Thursday evening, we will have a special teaching for the Daughters Only. So look forward to that on Thursday evening. Shalom, shalom, and remember to subscribe, to like, and leave a comment. Shalom, shalom. <laughs>